Hey there folks, got a new vid for you. So this is a follow-up on the Audacious Concept hex bit. So since the video, I contacted Audacious Concept and uh, I, I spoke to them on Instagram and I told them about the issues I was having. I gotta be honest, initially they didn't seem, I mean they were polite. Let's say they were polite. They didn't seem to be very receptive though. Um, if I can, I'll screenshot some of the conversation I had in the DMs. And then <clears throat> they must have researched uh, my page and looked at my profile. And then they discovered, because I didn't tell them I did a video on it. And they realized there was a video on Instagram and also on my YouTube channel. And they seemed to get very receptive then, which gives me pause. Because I don't want to be overcritical, but I want... A regular customer experience and I don't want them to kiss up to me because I have a YouTube channel that being said I could be completely wrong about that maybe they would have done the right thing I hope anyway so this was the original one with the uh, the failed uh, bit acceptor they sent since sent me two. so apparently if you remember this was housed like this right apparently this house is bits so you'll see that let me do this one first what they sent me has the hex driver and this housing unit including their bits now the bits that they included R stamp Weha. Yes. Now I don't know what the difference is. These are looks like it's some kind of a laser etch Weha. And then the ones I used that were from this Torx bit selector made in Germany, these are also Weha. These bits. Let's see if it shows. I can see. Actually, I can't even see it on this one. T7. Maybe I got the phony ones. Let's see. I thought these were stamped Wii, huh? There we go. We, uh, I don't know. Yeah, I guess not all of them are stamped. But this one has a stamp Wii, huh, name. So, to be fair... We'll test those out. And then I'll test out the bits they sent me. So the bits they did send me do seem to account do seem to fit. So if that is their goal, just to send to sell the tool with the bits, then I guess it shouldn't be an issue. It should be fine. Um yeah, let's take them all out and see if they all fit. Alright, so this is a T6, which I believe Rob Carter hates. The magnet is very strong. All right, it seems to fit all the bits they provided for me. They did say that the Weha bits have tighter tolerances. I guess it's a little better fitting. And maybe, well, maybe they changed this one. They said they were going to change it. They, I think they said that, and again, I'll, I'll screenshot it and uh, hopefully I can post it. They said that they pulled their product and they're redesigning them. That there was an issue with the one that I had, that Blade HQ had. So, to be fair, let's test out the bits in the Weha. You know, I'm only going to test the one that says Weha on it. Because if it doesn't say Weha, I'm not going to test it. So, this is a larger bit. And that fits. And this one, also stamped Weeha. And that fits. All right. Got to be fair. Weeha. Okay, this might have been the one in the video before. Maybe. I don't know, but this one barely fits. So, oh. So this one barely fits, right? So let's test it out on this one. Interesting. 
Huh. This doesn't seem to be fitting either. This could be a defective bit. Very, very interesting. Oh, wait a second. Wait a tick. Gotta be fair. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this one doesn't seem to fit. All right. So this one doesn't fit. It doesn't fit this one. Let's try this one. This one is a little snug, but kind of fits. I don't know. I'm going to test all of them. We are. Uh, fits. 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 Maybe it's just this one. Maybe I just popped in the one that was no bueno. Which one is this? T. This was in the T20. Almost fits. Not that I'll ever use that. T15 barely fits. Maybe it is a defect in the bits. Because it seems to be accommodating them. Now this one's not a Weeha. That fits nice. Alright. I don't know if they made changes, but let's see. I'll compare it. So this is the one they sent me. This is the one that, that didn't fit. Hmm. This one doesn't fit. So maybe they did do changes to it. Yeah, they absolutely made changes because this... So the, man, the person I spoke to was correct. They said it was a defect. This is not accommodating. This one accommodates that. Yeah, it's not accommodating this one. This tool is defective. All right. I I guess they were right. They, so that's what they claimed, that there was a defect in the products that I bought at Blade HQ, and they're going to send me these to replace the, the ones that fit better. So they did make some changes. Very happy about that. So awesome. I don't know when... When these bits will be available back, they're sold out on Blade HQ. I did notice something now, full, full review. So they sent me this one also to replace the my silver satin one. So they did send me another one also with bits, extra bits. I noticed that, not that it matters, but it matters to me. I mean, if you're paying 50 bucks for a product, I want consistency, right? Because since I did buy two of them. So I noticed that this one spins nicely. The original one actually spins better. See how quiet? I don't know if you guys can hear that. It's very smooth, very quiet. You can see that this one has a little bit of wobble and rattle. And this one just... <laughs> Just does not spin at all well. I don't know if you guys are. I might am nitpicking, but I also noticed there was a size discrepancy. Now I don't remember which one is which. Ooh, big difference, huh? Yeah. <clears throat> I don't know if you guys can see that. There's a size discrepancy there. All right? Is this the original? All right, so the original one, same size as the bronze. The satin one is a little bit taller. Some machining differences there. So anyway, quick vid, um, just want to update. So they did send me uh, the tools that will accommodate most of the Weeha bits, if not all. And I just want to follow up on to be fair. They did ask me to take the previous video down. In a respectful way, but I, 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 uh, I declined that. All right, guys, peace.